pleasure <laughs> as we take this call. Good morning, caller. Hey, good morning. how are you doing? It is so good to hear you. When the Irish Catholic masters were celebrating St. Patrick's Day at Government House. Now that rebellion failed, but our leading historian, Dr. Howard Fergus, argued that the fact that it did take place indicated that Montserratians were freedom-loving people with the will to fight for that freedom. That is what we celebrate primarily to the 17th of March every year. We have the Irish names, you know, like the O'Garro, Daly, Riley, Donahue, Sweeney, and Wayne Sweeney's right now. That's where the radio station is located, you know. Morning job now, just about 29 dot plus the hour of uh, 8 o'clock, and then you just had it. Hybrid Masquerade is doing uh, the number five track there for you. What are we going to do now? We're going to bring to you a uh, new feature for today. A new feature comes up just about now. I bring a sort of aggressiveness to the morning, you know. With me, you, you can't be sleeping. You, you, you've got to be up. I'm a sort of uh, what I'd call an arrogant broadcaster, you know. And I, I force people out of, out of bed. If I can even get into their bedrooms and maybe throw some water on them, I, I'll do that. Because I believe that in the mornings, people should be up and get the, the fresh air. And uh, oh, there's an old saying that the, the early bird catches the worm. You know, so I encourage people to get up. Even if you've been partying all night, you know that you're obligated to go to, to, to work. You have your children to feed, you've got to pay the bills. So why not get out of bed and let's go? So, JB, hi. Well, of course, it's very important. We're a very small community. And from since I've known myself, radio not only in Montserrat, but for the entire Caribbean has been very important. I mean, people want to know exactly what's happening around them. Almost everybody knows each other, so it's very important. You know, want to know who died, you know, who had a baby, you know, what's the big story, who got in an accident, you know, stuff like that. So it's very important. The time, mm -hmm. you know, very important. I think that we are very fortunate, really, uh, very fortunate, very, very uh, proud of where we are, how we've stood by each other even though everything else around us has been crumbling. Uh, you know, so many people have left, so many different people have come here to live. And you sit down and you wonder, well, our people are leaving, but yet other folks are finding Montserrat, this paradise, this place to be. And it makes you as a young person sit down and wonder, now, is this the right step? Should I maybe pack up and leave as well? But then when you sit down and you realize so many other people who come here, when they leave, they're, they're crying. You know, this is paradise. Montserrat is the greatest place on earth. How could other people leave?